Why we don't clap between movements. Late 18th century, when classical concerts were like small aristocratic gatherings, composers like Mozart enjoyed people talking and clapping during his performances. If audience reacted enthusiastically to a certain movement, he might even play that movement again. Then classical concerts became public in the 19th century, and claques were born. Claques were group hired to applaud for the performers. Many composers like Mahler, Mendelssohn, and Schumann found applauding disturbing to the concerts and asked audience not to applaud. When recording came in in the 20th century, applauding between movements simply created unnecessary noise on live CD recordings. Today, you can probably get away with clapping in North Americas, but not so much in Europe.